Cardiff lead Birmingham by a goal. So we'll hear about it shortly. Desperate for a home win. And Owen Doyle has been waiting a long time for his first goal. 26th goal of the season, but the other 25 were for Chesterfield. It's Morton nil. Air one. John Paul McGovern, of course, played for the likes of Sheffield Wednesday in this country. But now he's playing in Scotland for Air United and he's got the goal that's put them in front. Oh! Shall we go and hear about it? You <laughs> bet your life we won't. Um, instead, <laughs> instead no we're going to go and find out what's happening in the game between Cardiff and uh, Birmingham City, oh, Michelle Owen. God. Stay calm, Matt. Take my lead and keep calm. They're still playing at Victoria Park. Hartlepool lead Mansfield by a goal to nil. Blow your whistle, man in black. It is over. Surely, to goodness, every other result is in. We scored the first goal in the second half. It was at four o'clock. We an hour in the second <laughs> half. This is crazy. It's dark outside. Blow your whistle. <laughs> Elsewhere, Sheldon have lost to Old Exeter by two goals to one. Ipswich have won by a goal to the Richard Chaplow's goal. Uh, has turned out to be the important goal there as far as Watford are concerned. And Watford are going to lose ground at the top. Oh, they tell it's a great day for Bournemouth. They've won beating Middlesbrough. So the top two sides at the start of play today, Watford and Middlesbrough, have both lost. Bournemouth have won. Norwich have won. Derby lost last night. Brentford can only draw. It's a good day for Ipswich as well. It's all over! Thank goodness for that. We don't have to interrupt Alan Lambourne. Here he is with a classified check. Now, I have to tell you, my boss has been on the phone and told me to be more professional when it comes to Hartlepool. So I'm going to gird my loins and I'm going to have a lot of self-control when we look at the bottom of League Two. We're coming to get you! <laughs> look out, boys! <laughs> <laughs> the gap that was ten... <laughs> the gap that was ten is one. Ronnie Moore. Whew. What can I say? 36 points. Cheltenham, 37. Tranmere, 37. York, 38. It's so close at the bottom now. Carlisle on 41 are within reach of all the sides below them as well. Oxford are having a really poor run at the moment. They've won one of their last six games. They have 43. Cambridge United on 44. Also just seven points off the drop zone. Just leave it there for a while, director, please. <laughs> uh.